Angel is saying to you, Dear child, God says that everyone has a unique path to follow on earth, that you'll face many problems along the way, just like the one in this movie, but that in the end, you'll be happy, sad, and do other good things in life. Everyone's story is shaped by love and death, and each of us has our own. Chances for growth and discovery, my love. The path I've paved for you is one of a kind, completely yours. Picture how big space is, full of galaxies, stars, and other amazing things in space. Earth is just one of many little rock, but here on this island, Everyone's experience is from the time you breathe in until the time you breathe out. Every each person, even the Eden twins, will have their own story to tell. It all starts with you. You cry, laugh, fall, and get bigger. When you're a kid, even the smallest things can take your breath away, like a butterfly's tiny dance. Wings like the stillness of a pond's water or the brightness of a star far away. As the years go by, you not only grow physically, but also mentally. You become a new city, and the places you used to call home become new cities, or countries, or even just homes or jobs. Friends come and go over time, and leave, each leaving their mark on your heart. There may be short meetings, may last forever, but you should expect problems on rainy days and storms, my sweetheart. You might feel lost and overwhelmed. Brokenhearted, even though they are hard, these times are important because they make you who you are and strengthen your resolve that every problem you solve is a chance to become your best self. In the same way, there will be days when good times are full of to be happy, successful, in love, and satisfied. There will be days when you think about your struggles and be grateful for the wins, and there will be days when the beauty of life overwhelms you. Feel very lucky to be living, and you can expect love to play a big part of your journey. Love in all its forms, parental love that never wavers, the carefree love of brothers, learning to deeply understand your friends, and the passionate relationship with a romantic partner will teach you a lot, something that will make you strong as you go through life. Being a vulnerable patient and being willing to forget may be hard at times. Feeling alone? Know that there is always someone else there for you, no matter how bad things get. Faith is always with you, a guiding light in the darkest hours of your sorrow. Watch over you and whisper encouraging words to Judd M., even when it feels like the world is closing in on you. On your path, you'll have to make a lot of decisions, but some will be easy. Others are more complicated. Every action has a result that decides what will happen in the future. Trust your gut when you're thinking deeply. Spirit is telling you where to go and when to meet other travelers. Some of them will be teachers and guides. Being a light for people who need it is in you should accept these interactions with open arms because they give you a chance to make a difference. To make your trip more interesting and fun, you can also see the majestic mountains, peaceful forests, wide oceans, and beautiful natural landscapes. Enjoy the beauty of nature and let it motivate you. During your trip, you will have time to think about what you are doing. Is this the reason you're here? What is your job in this huge universe? As the amazing things that happen in life as the days turn into years and as the years turn into decades, you'll learn who you are. If you take these times and look for solutions, you may able to see as a thread in a fabric of events. Each thread, good or bad, is important for the tapestry to be finished. So my dear, as you start, as you go on your one-of-a-kind journey, remember that every, everything that happens in life, the good, the bad, the hard, and the happy, is and an important part of your spiritual path. Accept all of these things because they're what make your roads unique. 
May God bless you. Please remember that I am always by your side as you go on your journey. Every day, a hand bigger than your own guides you. Your time here is not just for getting from A to B, but also for learning to enjoy the ride, so keep that in mind. God, your road is truly one of a kind. Take it slowly, with hope, bravery, and love. Says, My precious child, trust and believe. Your journey is long. Not over yet. In fact, the most exciting parts of life are just around the corner. Like chapters in a book, each one shows a different set of events that make us who we are. The manuscript for your book is still being worked on, my love. The blank pages are ready to be filled. Stories you'll write about, even if it's something as simple as scream a laugh. It's just the start of a much bigger story. Many books start with this. Of a chapter about a child's innocent study of the world. You meet new people, learn about your surroundings, and maybe deal with some problems for the first time, setting the tone for the rest of your... As you hit puberty in your early teens, these years are very important for shaping your life. There may be both happy and sad parts in this book as the story goes on. As you get older, you start to find your identity and life goals through your first loves, breakups, school, and goals for the future. Feel free to type a man if you agree. But remember that. There are problems in every book that can make you feel like the whole world is pushing down on you. You in some ways, even though the trials seem to go on forever. I love you, sweet child. Remember that it's only during these hard times that our hero grows up and becomes wiser, and God becomes stronger. Be quiet, even when it's storming, and believe that faith is at the heart of your path. Never doubt your skills. Never doubt the timing of the world, and always remember that everything that happens, good or bad, is part of your story when the, it's easy to give up when the road ahead looks muddy, but if you trust the process, you'll get there. You'll keep going because everything happens for a reason, even if you can't see it now. You will also come across parts of your way that are full of happiness. Happiness love and celebrations at this point in time will realize that the problems you had were not unsolvable, but rather, stepping dealing with a lot of different people is a big part of getting ahead. Your tale is made up of important people, from close family and friends to teachers and even complete strangers. People you don't know might show up or play a big part in some episodes. As Chan gives you advice that makes you feel new things and makes your story better, and then there are the parts that act as bridges between major changes. For example, moving to a move to a new place, changed jobs, started a family, or even just getting to know yourself again. These parts can make you feel many things. Though times of change are hard, there is hope, anxiety, joy, and anticipation. Makes you believe that things will get better, but you can't be sure what the next part of your life will bring. But the fun is in the unknown. Turns and bends. It's in the sudden changes of exciting journeys into realms that haven't been discovered yet, and the times when plans don't work out. Remember that every event has a lesson and a good side. Tell your child that each day is a chance to start a new page in your As you keep writing your life's book, keep faith as your guiding light. Going over the parts that have already been written will show the good and ups and downs, wins and losses, laughing and you'll see through tears that every moment and experience they made was important. Your story is full of different sides, and the voice of your God is uniquely yours. Echoes remember that there is a treasure chest full of options, problems, story twists, and there are highlights on every new page, no matter where you are right now. I now have faith that the most amazing stories are full of love, success, and happiness. There are adventures waiting around the corner. 
your life story, according to God, is a work of art. Enjoy every step of the way and know that the best is yet to come. Life is a journey. A journey, not a goal. These words are a gentle reflection of that. You have the pen in your hand, but the pages are still blank, waiting for your creation. This is your one-of-a-kind story, so welcome it with faith and hope, because the best is yet to come. It will be easy. One's God gives you, my little child. My love stays the same. It's like a tapestry of many events, like the changing of the seasons. Some will test your soul from the inside out, while others will bring you warmth, growth, and peace. As soon as you wake up, these things happen that make you who you are. Meant to be, they set the basis for your path. A lot of different feelings surround you, and everyone else can see them. And exciting at first, the touch, sound, and sight in these carefree times. You feel loved and cared for, and you start to go out on your own. As you get older, you may make mistakes when you walk, at first, but after each fall, you'll learn how to stand up straight. My love, you are led and protected by an unknown force, though not every day will. It's true that God's love never changes, so let there be joy and laughter. When things are bad and the road ahead looks steep, and sometimes the obstacles are as small as stones that are easy to jump over, other times they can be as big as mountains that you need to be strong and determined to climb in the middle of all your problems. God speaks softly. Please know that you have help. You may have times when you question you're in these hard times. You may have moments when you question your worth or the value of your skills. Hope seems far away, and the world looks dark. Please pray for us, me, Jesus Christ, so I can find out if my spirit is really being tested nevertheless, despite any doubt, hopelessness, or task, God's love shines like a light. This love has always been there and it never will be. No matter what happens in life, it never goes away or gets smaller. Things may change, though. When someone is in a relationship or a friendship, their feelings and even a person's life path. Even though relationships change over time, there is an unbreakable connect the one you have with the person in heaven who can hear your whispers. His answer to your prayer is love, power, and direction. He sees your tears and your sighs. God's comforting presence may be felt even in the quiet times when you feel alone if you pay close attention. Are you lost or by yourself? God says, My love will be with you even when you're by yourself. The hard times you're going through are not tests, but chances to grow. You will realize this over time. They teach you how to be brave gentle, understanding, and strong. Get you in shape, shine you up, and be ready for what's coming up in the pages on this path. God's love keeps you safe in the worst storms, gives you rest when you're tired, hope when you're down, and drive when you're fired up. Some days will be easy as pie, and you'll feel like you're getting new experiences when you're thirsty. Feel like you can handle anything that life throws at you. Remember that God's love will always be there for you, no matter how low you fall. I know what it's like to be loved by someone who waits calmly and doesn't judge, never gives up on you. My love is in every breath, heartbeat, and dream, says God, my lover. As a child, remember this basic truth as you go through the complicated things in life. Mind problems will come up and go away no matter what you do. Where you are, what's going on, or how you see God's love around you, the love that God has planned for you will never change. No matter the seasons or the overtime, you breathe in dirt that's in the air. Your dreams and the, the things you say in your prayers are what hold your life together in the big web of existence. 
the endless love of there is a purpose for every thread, color, and pattern in God's world. It's so well put together that the fabric stays in place, says God. My love for you will never change, no matter how good or bad things are. You can count on it because it's always there. This is where you'll find the strength to face each day and the hope to reach your goals. A feeling of being loved and assured that nothing will ever let you down is a high we treasure. And loved above all else. But God says trust me more than having faith, knowing, and being sure that there is a divine design. At work, there will be good days and bad days, even when things go wrong. There is a power that can make you feel better on some nights as you travel the winding roads of life. An important truth that may keep your faith strong even when other people put you down. Determination and dependability aren't just empty words. They're powerful forces. There is life in you. It's the still, small voice that tells you to. As a child, they gave you comfort when you were going through hard times by telling you that everything would be okay. It was easy for you to trust other people because you believed that the sun would rise every day and shield you. Your parents and the amazing things that happen in the world when you... Your trust was pure when you were a child. Stable. But as you got older, life brought you problems and challenges. You may have lost trust because of past failures and heartbreaks. Traits that may have caused faith to waver as questions crept in. Trust in what God says will be. The bedrock of hope will be your guide as you go through the complicated world of life. Is trust that isn't foolish? It sees, feels, knows what sadness is saying, doubt, and still chooses to believe even when it looks like nothing is going right. If things are going wrong and the future looks bleak, know that everything you're going through is really a part of a bigger, more holy plan. Having faith makes sure that everything happens for a reason. Please subscribe to the station so that the good and the bad will be. God says that if you believe in Jesus, it will be integrated into your life. Every twist and turn of the thread is part of his special plan for you. When you trust someone, you let go of your need to understand and control them. Never know what will happen in life. Just trust that it will work out. Powerful are leading you to your fate, and a small voice is telling you to may strike you in the stillness when the noise of the outside world dies down, reassuring you of his endless love. This is God's voice of trust. Affects every relationship you make, move you take, and goal you strive for. It's what keeps relationships together and what moves things forward. Goals and the light that guides the way through. Trusting what God says opens the door to miracles help you in ways you could never imagine. There are endless options in the world of imagination, and trust goes beyond logic. It goes into the area of faith, which is where miracles and dreams come from. Born, it links the obvious and the invisible, the known and the unknown. Unknown, not everything will go smoothly, but your faith will help you through hard times. Be most clear, but it's also when you'll have to deal with the biggest problems. God says that faith doesn't waver, even in the middle of a storm, because it knows there will be a rainbow after it rains. The past rainbow foreign faith isn't fixed. It's dynamic and always changing, and improved by the meeting of new situations, problems, and successes. There is no such thing as endo. It's a process. God sees everything you do. I'm with you and have a great plan for you. Even when it's hard, believe in it, believe in me, and most of all, believe in yourself. Don't give up on yourself, even if you feel like a drop in the ocean. Huge ocean. Know that your tail is just one of many. Have faith, my love, as you, through the beautiful maze of life, take every road, 
no matter how small it may be, appear to serve a purpose in the light they cast. Let them be your be sure of your path and trust God's plan, believe in the process, and trust in the perfectly timed perfection of everything. Trust is the key that opens. When life gives you a puzzle, God says to accept it, value it, and let it show you the way. Trust that keeping a steady bond with God will make you happy. Hearing these words gives me life direction and makes me think that having faith is more than just thinking. It's a strong belief that acts as a guide, a source of strength, and proof that there is a higher power at work, even when things look hopeless. Everything in the universe has a reason, or so God says. That sounds like leaves rustling, waves breaking, and stars twinkling stars. Everything you do and everything that happens has a bigger reason for happening. No matter how big or small anything is, predetermined is meant to be heard, so please don't cut it off. Movie, like The Smoothly Falling Leaf, even though it's only a part of the story. Because of the seasons, this leaf went on a long and important trip. Before it fell, it grew and spread, providing air and shade for the place where God whispers, Your mission is the same as that of each waves in the ocean, both big and small, are touched by more than just the motion of water, is also changed by the moon's pull on the earth. The way the wind blows depends on how the earth is moving. The waves shape the shorelines that water plants and animals a place to live, and a steady reminder of the beautiful natural world is encouraging, and the same is true for life. May either move you forward or backward in life's events, follow a pattern and rhythm, just like the waves that shape your way every moment, God guarantees every high and low, every happiness and sadness, even when life's tides rise and fall. That my plan hasn't changed. Take a moment to look up into the dark night sky. There are billions of a huge space filled with galaxies, millions of stars, and our own sun. There are a lot of stars in the sky, and each one has its own life cycle. Years to reach us, these celestial bodies have given writers and navigators ideas. Scientists and thinkers see them as a sign of how God's creation has endless possibilities. It's important to remember that even when things are dark, there is light like a leaf on a wave, and that every choice you make, every step you take, and every problem you face is connected to the huge web of the universe. You might wonder, where you fit in with this amazing plan for every act of kindness. Every word of support and goal you set adds to the beauty of the universe, just like a leaf does. As a wave breaks and a star shines, you too have something unique to give. God says that everything we think and feel is like a rhythmic note. In the big picture of life, it's normal to wonder why you're here and to get lost in the vastness of the universe, but you two are needed for trees need waves to live in the same way that seas need waves to stay alive. It doesn't matter how good or bad an event is, it changes you. Smarter, kinder, and more fully reflects your character through thick, and know that God is always there to comfort you. Always keep in mind that you are a sign of a bigger, more divine force. There is a grand design in how everything around you, like air, works together. You breathe in the ground you walk on, the people you meet, and the things that happen to you. You can pick any of them, but they are all risks in a bigger story. Is a loving hand from God that shows you the way every step of the way. Your path is made up of free will and the way your choices affect each other. Having a greater power plan in your life is both a blessing and a calling. God says to care for it, treasure it, and never forget that it is holy. Be aware of your surroundings as you go through life as the leaves fall. 
become clear. You sit and watch the waves crash while listening to the simple stars show us a deep truth. We are all the same. Everything is interconnected and serves a reason. The universe is run by a God's plan. You are not just an onlooker. You are an important part of it. The beauty and depth of this work of art stand out in the vastness of the universe. Work is better with each step and choice you make as you look for these thoughts to serve as a gentle reminder of how much you are worth of God's beautiful creation and the complex plan that holds it all together. All together, it's a plane full of endless possibilities. Love, insight, and purpose. Look, my beloved child, I'm sending you signs to remember how much I love and know you. There is proof of a higher design, a reason, and most importantly, and there is an endless flow of love in everything in nature, from the the world to the tiniest living things on earth, nature's beauty and grandeur. Take a moment to look at the trees. They show that I have complete faith in God. With their strong roots and tall heights, all trees reach out toward God who tells us that trees give without expecting anything in return by turning sunshine into flowers, come in a huge range of colors, and give us energy and air. Each flower on bloom and splendor is different in how it was made and what it does. Working together to make something lovely, you can see my idea in God says in their never-ending journeys that rivers shape their rivers flow through mountain ranges and valleys, carrying nutrients to the dirt they pass through. They give life to everything they touch and are a steady reminder of God's love. The word, my love for you, flows through you like a river, feeds both of you. Your soul and the people around you are like the seas, which are huge and mysterious. The deep are home to many different kinds of animals, from the tiniest plankton to, no matter how big or small, every living thing has a job to do. The oceans protect the world as sentinels in the complex web of life that is life. Mountain ranges with sky-high summits that show the beauty and power of these things show that God is reliable and strong. The mountains are a steady reminder of how much God is present in their lives, God says on the cover at night. Another amazing star-filled galaxy in the vast cosmos shines brightly. God's way of showing His limitless essence is through a glimmer. You are not the only one who wants to talk to the universe at large. Agree completely with the variety of animal life and how it acts. Each animal is a proof of God's creativity. Characteristics that make you think of wonderful things, like a dog's loyalty, the grace of a deer and the strength of a lion teach me lessons and remind me of my in all living things, God says as they carry out their yearly cycle. The seasons come and go, and the world's colors change. Celebrate the renewal and return that the warmth of spring is a summertime perk, and the image of the autumn herald winter sets the stage for God's message of rest and reflection through the changing seasons. See the E.B. and flow of life and the everlasting promise of a cool, soothing fall. Rainwater feeds plants and cleans the air. It also brings life back to dry areas. With its steady beat, it fills up water sources like lakes and rivers. My love and knowledge are that God makes everything new, just like rain makes the ground new when things are calm. Careful listening can help you feel God's presence in the soft. I can hear bird songs, stream whispers, and the rustling of leaves here. Every sound in the symphony of nature's love lullaby says, I love you, from God. With the break of dawn comes a new beginning, we are told every morning. People were told of God's word and told to take advantage of the new opportunities that come with it. Sunsets mark both the end of and the start of a new era, 
Their bright hues filling the sky with hues being hopeful and thoughtful is beautiful to see. God plants the seeds of A in all its beauty. God's world gives us a new beginning and an ending, a sign of His love, knowledge, and presence, as well as a record of His glory, be with it, and just be. Absorbed. Let its amazing beauty wash over you and let it forever stand for the unbreakable bond we share. Solace lessons and a nature's embrace is a place where you can think and connect with the divine. Nature should be your safe place where you can learn new things and grow. Guide and a constant reminder of how much I love and know you, God, my beloved child. It ends. This text is a gentle reminder to look for God in everything, not just religious writings or not only in buildings but also in the beautiful nature around us, encouraged to connect, think about, and value your connection with God by the beauty of nature, which in its simplicity shows how much God loves us. Dear child, God says, Talk to me. Pour out your cares, fears, dreams, and he talks about his hopes for the journey of life and how communication builds trust. It's amazing how words can bring people together, warm their hearts, and help them make real bonds. Talking to each other is the best way to build ties and understand each other better. Another, you learned about the universe as a whole by talking to, asking about expressing feelings, exchanging ideas, and talking about your relationship to the being honest with God can help you understand and feel Him better whenever. When you pray, God hears every worry you have, no matter how small. Any fear you may be having, I will listen to it. Not at all. When you show them to God, they might all be born at the same time. If you let Him help you find comfort, direction, and healing, Saying yes to Anes is common. Join God's journey, and He will take care of your problems. And may have more than one cause, whether it's from the past or the future or problems you're having right now, remember that even a dim light can shine a long way. Shadow dreams are the way the spirit source flies. Help you reach your goals and give your actions meaning. God says that if you share your worries with me, will find light. Dream big, God says, for when you have faith in me and I will guide and bless you in everything you do. With your soul firmly in place, guiding you when roads seem dangerous and keeping you, God says your dreams are the seeds that will grow even when the storms are bad. Let me know about them, and I'll help them grow. It's about feeling like God hears and understands you when you talk to him or her. Soothes you even when you don't say a word when you love and understand life can be too much, and you might feel like you're not important. Compared to how big it all seems at times, but remember that God owns you. God is very clear that everything in the world, every thought, feeling, and want counts. Speaking to me in a way that is more like a toddler talking to a parent in a caring and trusting way. This is what true prayer is. When you open your heart and want to have a connection with God, it's not just a formal way to talk to God. Explains every honest statement to me, and every honest mood is a, I understand that it can be hard to express how you feel at times. The heart's language will do, even when we don't speak. That's what God says our spirits are, that they are still talking to each other instead of judging or demanding. This is the beauty of holy embraces. They love and understand communication. God has told me that my love is always there for you, so I urge you to be real, open, and honest, even though everyone has a different relationship with God. Observances and customs from different parts of the Bible may help you along the way. God tells me it's the little things we do together that matter. I don't want to be perfect. I want to be honest. 
This is a very personal and an honest conversation can be hard to have when you don't know what's coming next. On the other hand, remember to find solutions. That God hears every word you say in this huge universe with billions of other worlds. I might not always grant their wishes, but I will always supply God with promises that you are unique in every way, including your voice. I pray that as you go through the different paths in life, you will always remember that God sees the fact that you are different as a gift that you should share and cherish. Remember you're always taken care of, and you can talk to God at any time. I'm ready to listen and give advice, my loving child. God ends our joy and sorrow in God in heaven and, and me in hell trust love and a lifelong bond are at the heart of what we say when we talk to each other. We are aware of how important the divine is by using these words to make a link and build trust. Taking care of your soul is more important than just getting answers or helping me. My love, my rock, compass, is what God tells you to use. I am always with you. Love you with knowledge that never ends and love that knows no limits. There are quiet spots and stormy areas and life's huge ocean in the middle of the crashing seas of there is a compass, an anchor, and a leading star for when things get hard or change all the time. That shows God's love and knowledge are always there when you're not sure. Knowing which way to turn the compass can help you find your way when there is a lot of uncertainty. May my love and lessons show you the way. God says that the way of justice and truth is an anchor that keeps you steady during when things look like they're going too far. Having a base can help you feel more stable. To hold on to keep you fixed and from wandering too far from your center, God gives comfort in times of trouble. Let my love and presence be. It's possible to rest on the rock even when it's very dark outside. Light to help you find your way and get back home safely in the depths of your feeling down? May my light shine like a lighthouse, guiding you to safety and giving you comfort. That you are never really alone because God says there are choices in every. At this crossroads, you have to decide what to do. It's normal to feel stressed when you don't know what to do. If you don't know what to do, God tells you to use my lessons as a guide the right way to go so that your deeds are in line with love and virtue. Life is full of problems that, when you face them, test your faith and strength. To the test, stress and unsteadiness are common responses to, even though all of this is hard, God is reassuring me. May the security of my pleas let my presence be a source of strength for you. I will always be here for you. Dear Dark, You'll take on the challenge and win evenings, times of despair, and times of being alone. Our God wants us to always look up and find the guiding light of my love. Says that when hope sounds beautiful, but the way forward is unclear. The truth is that everyone has a unique path through life, and that we all learn and grow from our own experiences. Light up your path and tell you that hope is always close by. No matter what, God's love and understanding are always there, no matter what. Never ending, know that I am with you no matter what you are going through giving guidance, grace, and love. Remember that God's presence doesn't depend on how you feel. It's always there. There will be times when you feel cut off from God when the link seems strong. Loved one, even though you feel far away, I am closer to you than the beating heart of your own heart. While you try to be successful on earth, God says we risk losing. If we let ourselves, we can get in touch with God and find our spiritual path. Don't let worldly pursuits throw you off so much that you lose sight of God's guiding light. The Bible says the bonds stay strong. Never lose your balance and let my love always be yours. With a guide, you can strengthen your bond with the divine and make it stronger.
Let the dawn be a sign of my everyday prayers and requests for help. Love for you, as God encourages you with each new day that finishes with a sunset. May it serve as a lesson that you followed the divine compass. God loves and guides us all the time, even when we mess up. Things change and stay the same all the time. God says to my sweetheart, as you as you go through the ups and downs of life, may my love remain by your side. Your compass knows everything about me. Your compass and my beer. Your compass always knows that I am here for you. You are reminded of the immutable presence of God in living your life by these words in the love and understanding of God. This is more than just a nice thought. You will never really be alone. Answering yes, because I believe in God's plan, is what I should do. God tells his beloved child many times in life. There are times when your life's a thrill that you just can't help but beam with happiness and contentment. Group of moments that, when woven together, make up the beautiful fabric of your life where every stitch shows a dale and every pattern shows a face. There are feelings that everyone shows. A happy moment is like a beautiful patchwork blanket. A glimpse of heaven makes your heart feel good and it's easy to laugh. Grins. At this point, there are a lot of happy events, like birthdays, weddings, babies being born, and so on. God tells us to enjoy the beauty of a new baby, or even just a sunset. Enjoy these times, because they are gifts. I give it to you so that you can feel better and remember the great things about life, but there will be times when you feel sad and unsure, and agony, that they stand for the hard times and the lessons learned along the way, the way that even when things are bad, God is comforting you. Please know that I am, I am right here with you to help you and show you how to grow, change, and in times of trouble, they teach us to be wise, to keep going, to find peace, and you can trust that God will use every problem and pain for a better good. I shaped your character and set you up for the future through them. To be happy, take a moment to be still and let your thoughts roam. To get in touch with God and find the answers to life's questions in these, when it's quiet, we get together inside ready to talk about the love that leads to those transcendent, boundary-breaking, blessing-connecting moments when our souls feel an overwhelming emotion and our hearts feel God says, connected love is my essence, and when you love, you reflect me. Connect with God. There are also times in life when things change, like when we move, move to a new place, start a new part of our lives, say goodbye to someone or start over. Every change is guided by God. Seize the chances that come your way. Come your way so you can learn and grow. As time goes on, there will be times when you're by yourself, but not lonely. These are great times to think about healing and recharging. Have trust in God and know that you are never really alone. I am with you. Peace, quiet, and no noise at all. Every second is a whirlwind, a shadow that forms each new day, but everyone is important and serves a reason. God says the key to a happy life is enjoying every moment to the fullest. Even if you feel your faith getting weak and your paths look foggy, know that the divine light is there to show you the way. God tells us that when we doubt, those who want to see clearly will have to go inside and look for His light. An important part of life in the unpredictable fabric of life that makes us happy today might turn out to be a hardship for everyone tomorrow. Every moment, good or bad, is a stroke of the paintbrush that makes up your life. Masterpiece God says they're building an exquisite work of art in agreement that even short times leave a lasting mark on our lives. The good, 
the bad, the love, the lessons you learn shape and guide your life. God says that you, my dear child, should enjoy every moment, because the lines in this book are where you can find the wonder, wisdom, and holy presence of life. Serve as a moving memory of how every second was filled with having knowledge and memory makes the God tell his sweet child, My darling child, your time on earth is full of lessons. Being taught by beast is hard in many ways, but they all stress how important it is to enjoy every moment. Life is a school, and you play the part of every chance meeting and link. There are new chances for both teacher and student to learn and grow. Every day there are new problems to fix and new things to learn, according to God. No matter what happens, there is a lesson to be learned if you take the time to look for it. Character tests make you change and grow, and sometimes, indeed, it is when one is facing hardships that their strength fails. Instead of asking why God did what he did, persistence and honesty are strengthened, says to look for the lesson when things get hard. God says that every chance those who believe in his time growth can learn from whether they seized or passed up a chance. Opportunities are gifts from God that help us grow, learn, and try new things. No matter how unexpected things are, take every chance they come your way. We'll teach you something useful even if they don't get you back to where you were. We hope that as we get older, the relationships we have with other people show who we really are. People who have been through ENC count arguments, love, and loss can see your skills and weaknesses in them. Show us the good and bad parts of life and the lessons God has for each one. Deep down, we all know that both happy and sad events in our lives teach us important lessons. How to love, be patient, accept, and love yourself. When we forgive, it changes our memories, guides our decisions, and makes us who we are. Every event, no matter how big or small, has a lesson to teach us. God keeps stressing this point. Embrace every moment to the fullest, because they are all lessons, and lessons will come at times you will be. Life has put them in situations where it doesn't look like they can get out of them is scary. There are many things God can do that you can't imagine. Teach you a new sense of bravery and trust in the face of the unknown now you'll feel more hopeful. The unknown can be a great teacher if you let it be. If you can accept it, there will be times when you're filled with joy and your heart feels good. These events also have lessons to teach you. From God. Enjoy the moment. Be thankful for what you have and keep in mind that life is short and sadness, loss, and grief are natural parts. Still, even with all of these problems, the words of Jesus sound hopeful. We can have hope and find safety in him. If you ask me, following his principles is like drawing on a powerful spring that can't be broken when we remember that we are not. We can deal with our worries because we are going through this by ourselves. Trusting that Jesus is in charge no matter what is going on around us, things that make us feel calm as we go through life, let us listen. Especially when things look bleak, listen to what Jesus has to say. He has won the world. We can do the same thing. Keep your feelings up, and I won't be afraid. May these words stay with us forever as a lesson of how strongly we believe that He is with us and the peace that comes from knowing that love has power over fear, and we pray that they will be a light when we need it the most. Give us comfort when we're sad, and never forget how much they love us dearly in the heart of Jesus Christ, our Savior who lives far away, saves us. Believe these words with all your heart, they will help you. Keep going, have the confidence to face your fears, and the firm faith that Jesus is with you to get through any problem, 
No matter what problems you face, know that Jesus is with you and will show you the way. Giving you light on your way in a world that can sometimes seem crazy and unpredictable, we are asked by He is the rock that keeps us steady while the waves crash around us. When we feel stressed out, being with Him makes us feel better. Worry. His words resound in our minds, telling us to let go of our worries and, please God, don't be afraid if you put your faith in Jesus. He went through the worst pain people can feel and came out on top, giving us endless hope and redemption. We can be sure that when we run to Him, when life throws us problems, we can stay strong in the fact that we have Jesus to protect us, no matter how rough the seas and weather are. The lesson Jesus sent is not just comfort, though. It is a call to action. His lessons tell us to be brave and live a life full of love and hope. Faith. Being happy is a choice we make. It lets us show the love of God into the world and gives people who are having a hard time hope. When things get tough, remember that we're not punished for our problems, but for how we handle them. Deal with their problems, not only to test our mettle, but also to make our faith. If we hold on to Jesus' lessons, we can get through hard times. Within you are the strength to keep going when things get tough and the wisdom to understand how life works. Let's keep these Jesus quotes close to our hearts and let them guide us. Be there for each other with an open heart to change our minds and lives. If you're willing to lend a hand and listen, we could help get the word out about a message of hope and encouragement. We want to be like Him. He is a representation of Jesus' love in a world that needs it so badly, dear reader. No matter what you're doing right now, type them in. If you needed this and found comfort in what Jesus said, said, Keep your spirits up. Trust me. Don't be afraid. Take a deep breath and feel. When you know someone loves and values you, it makes you happy. Let his presence calm and clear your mind. These words may encourage you and remind you of your power. They give you hope that you can accept and get through the hard times. That come up in your life because they're chances to grow and change if you follow Jesus, be happy, and let his love shine through you. He gave you the strength to face any challenge and live the full life He planned for you, no matter what. No matter what problems you face, know that Jesus is with you and will give you strength through His love. And unwavering love. May your life show how much He loves, forgives, and cares for you. That always works here with you, my sweetheart, sending you love from above. Please subscribe to our YouTube channel to reach 5,000 divine subscribers very soon. Please share this video to your loved ones. Type Amen to affirm. Thanks for watching.